Hello, in this tutorial we will learn how to add a new parameter, a checkbox to hold the key to crouch. Before starting, I advise you to subscribe to follow my series of tutorials on this framework on which I spend a lot of time. The first step is to go to the HE underscore input setting structure and add a boolean variable there. Afterwards, go to the Horror Engine class and create a Boolean variable for the released event of the Crouch key. Create a crouch and uncrouch event from the code provided, then call these events like I did. Now we are going to modify the settings widget. First I am going to duplicate a line with a checkbox. From this new line, I will modify the description as well as the name of the button variables. As soon as it's done, go to the graph, then copy the code like me. You will return to the design side and use the click event of the two buttons and connect them to the previous code. Now we are going to modify three macros, 
Start with Rebind Input Settings. Get the player reference and modify the variable that you added to it. Then go to the Restore Mappings widget macro, copy code similar to what you want to do and make the appropriate modifications. Finally, in the Save Input Structure macro connect your variable from the break to the set node. Compile and save then test your changes. My code works, the parameters are saved. I hope this tutorial was useful to you. I'll see you next time for a new tutorial.